Hello everyone, this is Mayank Sangvi and I am back with another Framework Manager tutorial video and in this video we are going to learn about how to secure your objects in Framework Manager. So in this video we are going to discuss about the security. First we are going to discuss about data level security and in our next video we are going to learn about object level security. So let's start with security or how to secure your data in Framework Manager. In Framework Manager you can use data level security and object level security to secure your data. Now what is the difference between data level security and object level security? In case of data level security you apply a filter to a specific set of groups. So let's say you have a group for United States and another group is for Australia user and you want to filter or you have a sales table and sales table contains sales data from every country and you want to show the sales related United States to United States users related or sales in Australia and you want to show the sales in Australia to only Australia related users so for this you have to use data level security now how to implement data level security for this uh, in our test environment we have two groups one is Australia and another is United States the user Rosemary belongs to Australia group and John Liu is a member of United States group. Now we want to implement object level security. For this first I want to implement my object level sorry for I want to implement my data level security on my self security subject. For this or if you want to implement data level security on any query subject then you have to select that query subject and from action menu select specify data security in this window you have to add the group the required group for us I want to add two groups one is for United States and another is for Australia okay so first click on add group button and then you have to search for your required group. Now I want to add Australia and United States. Click on OK. Two groups are added. Now we have to specify the filter condition for each group. For Australia select filter create edit or embedded filter. Now I want to filter the sales record for Australia group based on my country name equals to my country English equals to Australia and here it is this is done for Australia click on OK and for our United States I want to create a filter on the same country column and this time I'm going to use United States in my filter okay click on okay and okay now next thing we have to check everything uh, we have to first save our data and then we have to create a report uh, this is our sales uh, it's time to publish our FM package so right click on your package and publish package next and first we are going to create a report and I am going to create a report with IBM Cognos BI administrator it is not a part of United States group or Australia group so for this user it will show the report will show all the countries related data okay and click on next publish my FM, my FM package is published successfully now it's time to create a report okay so public folder and go cells is my FM package launch report studio okay if you are watching my previous video 
in my previous video I didn't add the query subject country but for this specific video I created a new query subject country and in this I added country code and country we are going to use this in our report and if you want to see the playlist for IBM Cognos 10 framework manager just click on this I button and then you have to select the playlist okay no issue uh, I uh, we are creating a new report and I want a blank report and inside this I want let's say country and I want net profit just drag and drop this okay and it's time to execute our report for our IBM Cognos administrator or IBM Cognos BI administrator we are getting everything okay it's time to save our report so I'm going to save this let's say data security click on save and now we are going to execute the same report with John Blue. John Blue is a member of United States group. Okay, so it's time to execute this report. And for John Blue, we are getting only data for I United States. And same thing we are going to execute the report for Rosemary Rosemary is a member of Australia group okay data security the report is running and for Rosemary we got record only for Australia John Blue record only for United States and Rosemary records only for Australia and if I am going to execute my same report with some other user then we are able to get record all the records uh, other user only those user which is not part of United States or Australia group so my IBM Cognos BI administrator is not a part of United States group and Australia group so for this user I'm the report will generate for all the countries okay uh, now I hope you are able to understand how to implement data security if you have still have any doubts just leave a comment I will try to reply as soon as possible with proper resolutions so if you want to check the complete playlist on IBM Cognos 10 framework manager tutorial just click on this I button and the i button is display on your youtube youtube videos and then after clicking on i button and let me show you how to access the playlist for any specific video if the video is a part of playlist then you can access that playlist from uh, this is one of my video and if you are able to see this i in this video then this is the my website link and this is i think uh, the first one is for the website my website the second is for the next video and this third one is the playlist this video is a part of SQL Server 2014 tutorial series playlist so if you want to ac see all the videos or for all the IBM Cognos 10 framework manager related video then you have to check the same thing and you have to check or you have to click this to access all the available videos on IBM Cognos 10 Framework Manager tutorials. So that's it for this video. If you have any queries, just leave it in comment section. I will try to reply as soon as possible with proper resolution. And that's it for this video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to click on subscribe and like button. And see you guys in next video.